Hello and welcome to the Ask and Brian College Equine Department. This video is going to give you some information about the various courses and what they might be like if you wanted to join us. So we basically run two levels of courses within our equine department. So we do a level two equine care, which gives a really good broad overview of the equine industry. And it's really useful for students who are still studying towards their English and maths. We also offer two level three programmes. We do an equine management, which is really useful for students who are interested in going to the very practical side of the industry, into estate management, who are going to manage people. So very practical or enterprise side of the industry. We also run an equine sport, which is really useful for students who are going to go on to be professional riders, bring on young horses or very much a focus on the coaching and training side of the industry. For our level two courses, you need four GCSEs at grade three or above, and that should include two from English, maths and science, with at least a grade two in the remaining subject. For our level three, which is equivalent to A level, then you need four GCSEs at grade four or above to include two from English, maths or science, with at least a grade three in the remaining subject. Do note for our sport pathway, then there is a riding assessment and there are also other requirements such as um, fitness level. So do talk, talk to us if you want to know more information about that. We have excellent facilities here at the college which support all of the activities that you'd want to undertake. We are a BHS approved centre uh, and riding school and we're highly commended in all areas. We have on-site stabling for up to 50 horses and we typically have 35 to 40 in at any one time. We do have paddocks and fields. We're very fortunate that our horses do get the opportunity for uh, stretching their legs and getting regular turnout and also we can ride in them at the appropriate times of the year. Our yards are split up into three indoor yards and a small outdoor yard. So that enables different groups of students to work without getting into each other's way and means that different types of horses can be housed together. We also have a full cross country outdoor course. We have a few jumps down in the local area, but we also run a BE affiliated event every year. So we have a full set of jumps for that. On top of the usual stables, we also have a horse walker. We have a stocks with solarium, as well as other various bits and pieces around the place and full equipment rooms. So a typical week with us, uh, you'll probably spend three to four days a week in college and one to two days a week out on placement. You'll cover all of the key areas that you might think of. So all of our subjects have a synoptic or core subject knowledge. So that includes health, uh, welfare, business in your second year, feeding, nutrition, um, rehab for our second year level threes. So that covers the core knowledge. And then depending on your pathway and interest, then you do other specialist modules. So at level two, we've just run the one pathway, but at level three, then the sport pathway includes riding on the flat, exercising horses, riding horses over fences, coaching. So there's lots of different things, very much focused on that side of the industry, as I mentioned before. Our management students get into grassland, the state skills, rehab. So again, they're uh, competition grooming. So they're very much focusing on that very hands-on practical running and keeping in charge of the world side of the industry. You'll also work on the yard. So our level two students have slots as in part of their main timetable. So when you're already with us, you'll spend some time on the unit helping the yard staff and learning those practical industry skills. Our level three students are rotated on, so it's approximately one week in five or six, so about once every half term. Then you'll come in, you can live in with us if you want to, and you'll do a week of yards, including morning and evening yards and weekend yards. But that gives our students uh, real industry experience and can experience a wider range of activities on the yard. You'll also take part in employability sessions. These also support your work placement, but they also uh, will help prepare you for university applications, updating your CV and the other various skills that you need to get a, a real good start in the industry. If you haven't yet reached a grade four, then you'll also have bespoke maths and English sessions in your timetable. Um, and enrichment is often available, so depending on capacity and what sessions we've got available that could include enrichment towards your BHS exams that might include riding or it might include other activities as and when we have them available. 
So the course is divided between theory and practical. So depending on what sort of placement you do, because bear in mind you do spend one day a week doing that. So you might spend up to 50% of your time doing practical activities and the other 50% give or take will be more theory based. The course is assessed in a variety of ways, so all of our programmes do have a year end exam, but they also have practical and theory other assessments. So some modules are ongoing assessment, some subjects um, will have some written tasks at the end of the year. So there's a variety and we can go uh, through that with you. You don't necessarily need any previous experience to, to do a course with us. So the majority of students, as long as you've got a strong interest, we could start you somewhere. If you haven't ridden before or don't have regular access to horses, then you might find the level three pathways a bit difficult to get started with if you don't have the opportunity to practice those skills outside of college. But again, we can help you with that. and I'm sure we can direct you to some method or some pathway if working with horses is absolutely something that you're interested in doing. There isn't a set uniform, um, but we do have uniform items available, so you're perfectly welcome to buy, buy those with us and branded with us. You will need the normal horse riding PPE, so suitable boots, uh, a, hard, a riding hat up to current standards, gloves, uh, and if you're riding, you may need a body protector uh, and a whip and, and other items as well. But again, we can talk that through with you. As well as the yard duties that I've already mentioned, you do have to complete a number of external work experience hours. So in total, our level two and our level three year one students will do 150 hours and our second year level three students do 350. But you do get an extra day a week on your timetable to complete those. But what that means is our students get a real credible industry experience, which is a real boost on your CV and makes you very competitive when you go out and apply for a job. So we do have various online events, so you're more than welcome to come along and ask your questions that way. You can also see on the screen uh, an email address for our head of department, Flo Clarkson. So again, drop her an email if you've got any questions that you'd like us to answer for you. You can now apply, uh, so for next September applications are open. So again, on the screen, you can see the website address to go for. There's also lots of other information on the website, including transport, accommodation, uh, financial, learning support, so all the different things that we can offer to help you with our journey, then, then do go along and have a look. Thank you very much for listening and we look forward to speaking to you soon.